when moving through the field, you're either here or you're here at all times. Never here, never down here. Okay. My name is Ashley Taylor. I am a native Texan. I've lived here my entire life. You okay. now have a live loaded gun. I have a background in education, and prior to what I do now, I was a principal. Oh, geez. Okay. I've never even shot a shotgun before. All right. I did it! Oh, well, that's new. I am excited about giving it a try, and it's just something completely outside of anything I would ever do prior to this. I'm Josh Crumpton at Spoke Hollow Outfitters. So in my 30s, I was pretty interested in the um, sustainable food movement, which in a roundabout way led me to hunting. As I got into it, I realized that I really had a fuel and a passion for introducing people to hunting, bringing new people into the outdoors. Sometimes the bird is gonna fly right at our face. You're gonna go to shoot it like this. It's gonna come go over your head. Instead of doing this, we get in the process of doing this. That makes sense to me. Then I'll turn this over to you. Okay. Well, I guess too that you have to know what birds you're allowed to shoot to, right? And when you're allowed to shoot them and when you're not. And... There's so much more to it. When it comes to hunting, I really have no background, um, really no experience. Oh, God. They <laughs> were right in my face. <laughs> oh, it just, again, it just happens so quickly. Like, oh, there he is. Oh, God, it's right there. I don't want to shoot that way. <laughs> I got to be ready. Working with Ashley has been fantastic. I don't want to miss the bird. Uh -huh. A lot of times we get people who come out and in one day we cram in a lot. We go from clay shooting to into the field to shooting birds. But working with the stewards program and, and having Ashley as a mentee has given me an opportunity to really, over a few months, really talk about the dynamics of shooting. Do it. Nice. There yes. it is. Yes. <laughs> Good job. Nice. <laughs> yeah. Sally here. Sally here. Oh my gosh, I did it. Dead bird. Harvey. Dead bird. Here. Sit. Oh, right to you. Sit. sit. You want to sit first? Sit. sit. Put hand on it. Good boy. You can tell it to him because it's going to be really cool to follow Ashley through this yeah. season and, and watch the challenge get turned up each time. I have a bird in the back. I am so excited right now. <gasps> yes! I want to keep going. <laughs> yes! I love it. Good. Ready? Follow me this way. RV, come on. Get used to this idea of keeping track mentally. All the moving parts, are. yeah. <laughs> Last year, my sister went on a mentored hunt. And on the hunt, she was talking about how it completely changed the way she viewed hunting and viewed hunters. And so, you know, I really wanted to be a part of that. I wanted to see what it was like. We got a dog on point in front of us. Okay. Keep moving. Right. Keep moving right there. Now call. Oh, for it, there's two right here. Okay, now call for RV. So they're gonna go that way or at my face? Maybe at your face, but I'm gonna get down. <laughs> go ahead, you're in charge, boss lady. What? <laughs> Say the magic words. RV. Good. Nice! <laughs> that was awesome! <laughs> Tell him, dead bird. Dead bird, RV. Heel. Sit. Good boy. Drop. Good boy. I worked with Stewards of the Wild. We volunteered our time, provided our dogs, and helped this mission to get more adults into the uplands. Yeah. 
today. I'm excited, I'm nervous. Nothing new out here than anything else we've done before. Just more challenging. Let's go get your bird. So we're gonna walk from here all the way along that cliff band behind us. This is super humbling. I got birds above me and I got one single peeled off below me that I actually took a couple shots at that we might be able to run that thing down. Over. Something's like, oh my God. <laughs> This hunt was so different because we were always on the move. You have to be ready to move quick. Do it again. There's a lot of youth programs out there, and youth programs are critical, but there's not enough adult-focused programs like this. Yeah! These are adults that have families. Ashley has kids. And these are also adults who can immediately start to support conservation efforts. And now she's out there to support and grow the mission. So we recruited one more person. And I feel so blessed and so grateful to be a part of this.